Hello, my name is Joshua Tran. Hi, my name is Chantel Morris. My name is Carl Young. We're here to teach you how to make a flourless chocolate cake. Let's stop, let's stop by cracking an egg. Now we gotta separate the egg yolks with the egg right, white. And you can do it however you want. Some. Now, after we separate the egg white, the yolks from the whites, we, st we start beating it. We beat the egg so that we can add some air and give it some nice thickness to it. And after a while, when, when it thickens, we add the sugar. Now, as we add the as we beat the sugar with the eggs, it will start to thicken a lot more, and it will give it a, a, a bit a better texture. And along with the egg whites and the egg mix, the egg yolks, we will. The next step you want to do is over a hot water bath in a stainless steel bowl. You want to melt down your chocolate chips, your semi-sweet chocolate chips, and some butter. And it should be nice and smooth, just like so. Then you want to incorporate the chocolate to the egg yolks, and then you want to fold it in until it's nice and smooth. So it should come out looking like that. And the next thing you want to do is take your egg whites and you want to beat them until they're nice and have a soft peak. Then you want to add a little bit of sugar and then you want to whip them again to another soft peak. Then, then you're going to add the egg whites to the chocolate mixture. So what you want to do is you want to fold this in until it's nice and smooth. So when it's all incorporated, it should have that nice light color, just like so, and it should be kind of smooth. And once you're done incorporating, this is what it should look like. At this point, you're going to have a uh, ramekin that has been buttered and a piece of parchment paper cut out for the bottom that's been buttered on top and bottom. And you want to fill the ramekin halfway fill, full. And you want to cook this in a water bath, and the reason is, is it's going to gently cook it so it'll be more light and fluffier. Um, and it's a good recommendation to have the water boiled beforehand that you can pour it into the pan. And then you'll place it in the oven at uh, 350 degrees for 20, uh, 30 minutes. And then this is your final product. Hope you enjoyed the video. Bon appétit. Bon appétit.